This is a 24 voltage 15 watt DC brushless vibration motor from ATO. As you can see, it's very small and has a thick mounting base. Different from AC type vibration motor with only two power lines, the brushless DC vibration motor has three power lines blue, brown, and white. This is the controller that matches the vibration motor. The nameplate on the top of the controller has varying instructions. Let's pay attention to the power interface of the controller and the motor line interface. The back of the controller is the wiring port. Next to the wiring port is its wiring identification. Next, connect the power cord and the motor power cord to the terminal. Don't worry, the process is not that complicated. Here, this is a 2 ohm potentiometer for remote control of vibration motors. According to the nameplate instructions, it will be connected to 5 voltage SP GND. This is how a completed wiring looks like. Each rail must be connected in accordance with the nameplate instructions. Next, power dock. After power on, the ALM light will keep flashing before the motor starts. Then turn the controller on. Twist the speed control knob, then the vibration motor will start to vibrate and the speed of the vibration motor will be displayed on the LED. The higher the speed, the higher the vibration frequency. Similarly, we can use an external potentiometer to adjust the speed. The speed display will be displayed on the LED with a delay. Turn the controller to off. ATO has various types of vibration motors including AC type and DC type. If you are interested in it, click the link below and comment it if you have any questions. Thanks for watching.